Hello friends. Today I'm gonna show you my coins from the Danish West Indies, as well as some information about their price, and where to get these coins. The Danish West Indies was a Danish colony located in the Caribbean Sea, at the east of Puerto Rico. These islands, originally inhabited by the Siboney, Carib, and Arawak people, were named the Virgin Islands by Christopher Columbus on his second voyage in 1493, in honor of Saint Ursula and her virgin followers. Over the next 200 years, the islands were held by many European powers, including Spain, the United Kingdom, Netherlands, Denmark, Norway and France. It wasn't until 1666 that the island of St. Thomas was occupied by Denmark, which five years later founded a colony there to supply Denmark with sugar, cotton, and other products. In 1684 the Danish claimed neighboring St. John, which had been used primarily as a base by buccaneers. This territory remained under Danish rule until 1917, when Denmark sold the entire territory for $25 million in gold to the United States. Under the American administration, the islands were renamed as the United States Virgin Islands. The Rigsdaler was the currency of the Danish West Indies during the 18th century. These coins were made of copper for the low denominations, and silver and gold for the higher denominations. The dollar replaced the Rigsdaler in 1849. These coins were made of bronze and nickel for the low denominations, and silver and gold for the higher denominations. The dollar was replaced by the US dollar in 1934, 17 years after the Danish West Indies became the US Virgin Islands. The two coins that I have in my collections correspond to the dollar period. The one cent is made of bronze, with a weight of 3.8 grams, and a diameter of 23 millimeters. The obverse of this coin shows a crowned monogram of King Christian IX, surrounded by the name of the territory in Danish and the date below. The reverse shows the denomination, together with a trident, a caduceus, and a sickle. 500,000 of these coins were minted in 1905. The 10 cents depicts the bust of Frederick VII of Denmark facing right, and the date below. This coin is made of silver, with a weight of 3.5 grams, and a diameter of 21 millimeters. The reverse shows a sugarcane plantation, with the name of the territory above and the denomination below. 140,000 of these coins were minted in 1862. These coins are relatively hard to find, because of their low mintage. Let's take a look into the World Coins catalog to have an idea about the official value of these coins. As you can see here, the value of the one cent is around $9 in very fine condition, and $22 in extremely fine condition. For the 10 cents, we need to search on the 19th century catalog, Here you can see that the value of this coin is $18 in fine condition, and jump to $50 in very fine condition. And if we search for these coins on eBay, we can see that the price of the one cent varies a lot, from around $20 to $60 or more, depending on the grade. The same for the 10 cents coin, starting from $35. Well friends, I hope you liked this video. I'll see you again next week, to learn about other interesting coins. And remember, if you like this content don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.